In Metropolis from Halo 2, you end the level by blowing up a scarab from the inside, where you have to jump on on a long platform. And I thought, what would happen if you just let the scarab continue on its path? Would the game end, or would something else happen? So I decided to put that to the test. This will be pretty quick, but it was interesting what I found out. To get to this point, you first have to clear a bridge of Covenant forces. As you move on, you enter a tunnel that leads you to some outside areas. You follow the scarab as it continues its path, and this leads you to a building where marines are being held inside. After you eliminate the outside forces, you get into the building and watch the scarab climb onto the tower as you move up trying to stop it. Once you reach the top, there's this long platform as the scarab walks beneath it, and you're able to jump on at that time. And this is where the test really begins. At this point, I thought the scarab would trigger something that would reset you to when it was beginning to crawl out, or that it would just kill you and then send you back to that point. Some way to get it to reset and allow you to have opportunity to jump, but I noticed there was a section farther down, and it began to turn, so that seemed like it would continue on to that path. If you missed that, Cortana said, it can't go any further, we have it trapped, meaning that no matter which time you jumped on the scarab, it would eventually go to this point. And I was honestly disappointed because this really ruined the kind of intensity that you had. Even if you let it go, it would stop somewhere and couldn't do anything. There was no real struggle to get it blown up and destroyed before it reached any danger because it got stuck no matter what it did. And that seemed confusing to me. But then I looked over the cutscene and I found something interesting. I have a screenshot here if you missed it, but at the end of the platform, you can see that same little outcrop that was shown while actually playing the level, which meant it was always supposed to go to this point, but we always jumped early, or at least I did. I think many people just jumped early onto the scarab and got the job done, way before they actually needed to. It had already set up for the scarab to get stuck in the first place, but it felt so much cooler to just jump right on and feel like there was the actual sense of threat. But that was never the truth. <laughs> 